And I was scared. I was scared that when I started to share what, how people would react to what I had done. And I was scared to deal with those feelings myself because it was so painful. I had a pretty good childhood, actually, and when I entered adulthood, I started to experience a lot of loss. And it started with the termination of two separate pregnancies. I, uh, followed by more loss, I had a few miscarriages, and those were very painful years. I, I was always searching searching for love and searching for happiness, only to fall short. After I had my two abortions, I, and then I had my two miscarriages in my marriage, I thought I was being punished. I thought this was God's way of showing me that what I had done was, was so bad. I did not know who Jesus was. I carried around with me for so many years such shame and, and guilt and pain. But the Lord started to work on my heart and started to soften my heart. And as I was going through the pain and heartache, I I opened up my heart and I received Jesus. And I don't know how I would have gone through that without Him. He transformed me in so many ways. But I still, even though I was a Christian, I carried the shame and the guilt and the pain, the failures. I came across the Bible study of Healed and Set Free. I knew that that's something that I needed. Um, I thought that I had already gone through all these emotions, but I think there were so many that were still buried in my heart. And it was through the tools of Healed and Set Free and being able to allow the Lord um, to show me what was still in my heart and to be able to give those emotions and those feelings to the Lord and then find forgiveness, true forgiveness that only God can give. And when I finally allowed the Lord to bring those silent secrets up into my heart and mind and to finally deal with the pain, I was scared. I was scared that when I started to share what how people would react to what I had done. And I was scared to, to deal with those feelings myself because it was so painful. And it was very hard for me to forgive what I had done. Um, how could I? <laughs> but through the Lord and through His love, I was able to experience true forgiveness. That there is nothing that God won't forgive. That there is nothing too big, too terrible for Him to forgive. And that to me was so freeing. And the feelings that you feel after you let go and give it all to God and truly rest in His forgiveness is it's like a huge weight lifted off your shoulders for the first time in your life. That's why Jesus died on the cross, was for us to be free, was for us to live abundantly. And I don't have to search because I had found what I had been looking for my whole life. I know that God can't change my past, but He has changed the meaning of my past. Lingering hurts can cripple, damage, and paralyze our mind and soul, creating a person we don't want to be, keeping you 
and even your entire family in shackles. But Christ said, You shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. What does it mean to be truly set free from life's hurts? Healed and Set Free is a ministry for women that is offering hope for the brokenhearted.